Hello everyone, how's it going? Doctor Incompetent here, and let's play some Lightyear Frontier, shall we? Picking up where we left off with our Let's Play, and I got a lot of quests. I got a lot of things that I need to restore, and that's what we're here for. Alex, good evening, good to see you. So, if we check out the map, we are currently in Edge Cliffs, which is where we can get copper and red color flower. We're here to get copper. And we have the lowland plains, which we need to restore, but we don't have the technology to do that yet. And we have the yellow forest and the mountainside coast to also get to, but we need to develop um, some stronger instruments. So I'm trying to get the vacuum harvester power up to one, which requires some Karut oil copper wire. I'd like to boost my spike saw power, my sprint speed. I also need to build the radio tower. So I've got quite a few little things to do. Oh, and speak of the Karuts, let's go for it. Siloam, good evening. Good to see you. So I think I was up here. Have I fed these guys? Um, I haven't. These are Snorks, but I don't have any of the food that they like. Hey, Dirty Mop, good evening, good to see you. So, I'm going to just kind of putz around up here and see if I can find any of the fantastic copper. But we also, I mean, if I could find some hidden treasures up here, that would be good too. So, if I, let me just check my inventory. Where am I at? I have 10 copper. I'm at 51.8 out of 90 uh, pounds, I don't know, weight units that I can take. So, hmm, hmm, anything up here? This is going to be a good question for, can my mech even make it? And it's, that's pretty much a no. All right. Wow, look at that planet beautiful view. Heathrun, good evening. Yes, live and drink oil indeed. Alright, I'm going to get out. I'm just going to see if on foot I can get to anything interesting over here uh, that would be worth my while. Maybe there are some treasures. Uh... I don't want to get too far away from my mech, and I don't want to fall down to some place where, you know, I can't summon the mech again. That would be less than ideal. Uh, I don't really see anything tremendous over here that makes me feel like this is the right thing to be doing. So I'm just going to go back to the safety of my robotic friend, shall we? There he is. All right, getting in. Okay. So, uh, let me just check out over here. And, well, I guess we're just going to jump down, see if we can find anything fun. And now I'm in a lowland plain, so let me look at the map. Uh, okay, so I've kind of gone over the edge of the edge cliffs into the lowland plains, which is okay. We'll just wrap back around to get out of here. Alright. You know, one of the things I really enjoy about this game is that you don't actually have to rest. You know, it's very chill in that way. It's like, yeah, you could just be in your mech all day long. Go for it. I guess Medieval Dynasty also allows you to do that, for the most part. But this doesn't even have stamina. It's quite wonderful. Alright, let's go. Oop, here's some Karu. Let me get my stuff. Yep. Get ready. And... Let's see. Let me check the map. Oh, I'm still comfortably on the edge cliffs. Let me just look for some more copper. 
I'd like to get about 300 more. <laughs> because I basically need it for everything. They want that nice fodder. I don't have that. Now, when I was tooling around over here, yep, I did... I think I already explored this ruined site pretty thoroughly. And... Is this where the trove of copper awaits? It doesn't look like it. I remember finding this... Oh, new day. Little spot that was just replete with so much copper, and I was oh, like a good night's rest. overjoyed. There's some copper right ahead of me. Yes, we will build something jaw-dropping. I love the fact that it's raining. So the rain means um, our crops are just thriving. And we need our crops to thrive because we need carrot oil for just about everything. And speaking of the carrot, there's some up here. Let me just kind of spy. This is the lowland plains. So I'm going to stay up here. Excuse me. All right. I tell you what, these edge cliffs make me sneeze. <laughs> Thank you, Alex. All right, here's some more copper. Now, I don't have the animals fed, so it's going to be a little bit extra work to get this done. But I'm going to go home. Made it. The Meadows. I know the Meadows. It's where I'm from. Look at all these crops waiting for us. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Dirty Mop, that's a good question. Maybe one day. I don't think I've actually played Skyrim on stream. It is a game I've beat a couple of times, but um, I played it basically before I was doing YouTube. So there's no, there's no record of it. It is a great one, though. Speaking of that, is there any word on uh, Elder Scrolls 6? Seems like it's been a bit. All right. Uh, we're going to go here, and we're going to make carrot oil. All the carrot oil we can. Heathrun, I guess that's true, right? Doesn't count. Didn't really happen. All right, so we need copper wire. Something was said, but it was a disappointment. Like, we have no plans to even dream about releasing that. So, by the way, check this out. Somebody told me this on the YouTube comments. You don't actually have to go up to the little panel. You can just stand right here and push X to do the upgrade depot without even moving. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool little feature. All right, so we need to upgrade our vacuum... Right here. Bam. Well, I gotta say that's too bad, but I can only imagine how massive a game like that is. Like how difficult it is to build a game like that. Uh, we need oil and wire. Okay, we need a lot of oil, but I do want the sprint speed upgrade. Oh. Okay. I didn't understand how to do the path. Now I see it. Hi, you selling anything good? 
Now, she does have, uh... Crow maize. Seeds. I'll buy nine. If they're on sale. Sure. Do I got anything I want to sell you? Not really. I'm kind of bad about buying the, uh decorations I should be better about it I just buy them when they're on sale and I don't really buy any of the cosmetic stuff you know I tend to agree with you about AAA stuff but I will say I was just playing again there are some AAA games that are actually good um, for example Final Fantasy Remake I, is amazing. I haven't played Rebirth, but Remake, I don't know. I mean, it's by a AAA studio, so it's got... I know they spent a bajillion dollars on it. It's fantastic. All right. I'm out of care roots, so let's start planting, shall we? You know, Heathrun, I keep meaning to try Outcast. Yeah, I guess that's true. They had to do a good job. Yeah, $70 is really tough to pull the trigger on. Oh, great, Heathrun. You know what? I heard something similar to that, my friend, which is that a lot of the beef about Dragon's Dogma 2 is kind of overblown. Like, from what I heard, some of the stuff about Dragon's Dogma 2, like the... the cosmetic stuff being able to change your appearance that you can actually earn the ability to do that in game without purchasing it rather easily so it's not like you have to buy it that's the only way you can do it or something like that i don't know how true that is that's just what i read in an article i'm playing um i'm not Oh, oh, you're asking Heathrun. I haven't played it yet. There we go. Get those seeds in the ground. What else do I have seed-wise? I got Rabbage. Man, I don't need that. Yeah, that's incredibly expensive. There we go. I got a wooden crate. Oh, by the way, check this out, everybody. So this is now incorrect in my guide and in my Let's Play, but notice in the bottom right corner, um, they have, I think on March 20th, they released a, a hotfix patch. They doubled the storage capacity of all containers in the game. I was reading the patch notes a little bit. So you, you have much more storage space. It was a little bit too tight before, and I'm glad that they adjusted that. I love the first Dragon's Dogma 2, um, Heathrun. I had it on, was it PlayStation 3 or 2 that originally, I think it's 3 that originally came out on. It was kind of a sleeper, like nobody told me about it, and, um, oh man, I don't have enough copper. I picked it up and it was awesome. I'm just going to see if I have an extra copper wire lying around. I do, but I don't have the oil yet. Oh, right. I got to... A... 
You know what is, uh, I actually ended up playing on the channel a little bit of the Dragon's Dogma 2 reboot. Right, I'm going to carry this over here. Actually, I'm going to try to, yeah, I just launched it. That's two. I need one more. That's it. One more and we're good. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Please don't be out. Okay, it's out. <laughs> I'm glad that you like it. The dirty mop. I, it's an um, SM58. It's a Shure microphone. S H U R E, and it's an SM58. They're not that expensive, as far as microphones go. You can get really crazy with buying microphones. Shure makes really nice microphones for like podcasting and stuff like that. This is just a regular performance microphone. Um, I'm going to go down here to the planes and see if we can clean it up. Do, do, do. All right, here's some Kiru. Uh, I'll go to the planes this way. This is fine. Oh, cool, Alex. I saw something. Is Terry Tech Worlds the one that is a sequel, or is that the, the first one? I saw an article popped up on my feed about that. All right. Let's see if we can clean this up, people. Spiritual successor. Okay, cool. Yeah. Did I not d install my upgrade? Maybe I forgot to install it. Let me look at my mech. Or maybe you need another level. I thought I purchased the vacuum harvester upgrade, but maybe you need level two. Yeah, I thought it was automatic, so maybe it's that I need level 2 and level 1 not good enough. I didn't, it didn't even occur to me. Hey, Splays Town, what's up, my friend? I know, I am with you. This game is so fantastic. I'm having a blast also. Oh, looks like there's something in there. What is this? Fossil fish. Hey, Ninja Joe. Good evening, my friend. Good to see you. You know what, Ninja Joe? It's embarrassing, but Astroneer is actually a game that I haven't played yet. I think I have it for free through uh, Game Pass. I just haven't booted it up yet, but I, I'm excited about trying that. All right, let me go over here. Yeah, Ninja Joe, that's what I hear, my friend. Thank you for reminding me about that. All right, there's some uh, fossil eggs over here. I'm going to try to get these I think what I'll do is I'll get out of the mech see if I can get it on foot by the way somebody else told me about this in the comments that you can just um, shoot this at your mech and it will grab it which is pretty awesome alright um So I'm on Stepstone Peak, which, if I look at the map... Oh, Mountainside Coast. Let's see if I can clean this one up. This has some water issues. You can... Uh, or some slime issues. Let me see if my 
current vacuum is strong enough. There's some more eggs up there. Heathrun, I shot some petrified eggs at my mech, and those are items that you can just sell to the vendor for good money. There's a lot of just sellable items. Oh, I don't know why I'm getting out. That's not the right thing to be doing. No, okay, I need my hose to be upgraded before I can do this territory. Okay, good to know. Yeah, this is like one of the last ones. No, Dirty Mop, I still have a few zones to go before I can open the door. I, uh, I'm working on that right now, my friend. Mountainside Coast. I'm able to pick up the weeds on Mountainside Coast, but I need a stronger, uh, hose. Now, on the other area I was just at, I'm able to spray the stuff, but I need a stronger vacuum, so that's where we're at. Uh, here's a ruin. Have I done this one yet? Let me see. Edge cliffs indeed. Yes, I have. Alright, uh... This is where I'm always trying to get copper. No copper there, just a rock. Yeah, there there can be a bunch of copper right here, but you have to be feeding these animals. And these, you could check the map for this. These guys in the edge cliffs, they want nice fodder, which I do don't have any of at the moment. I can go try to make some. Oh my god. I do that all the time. I just run into the tree. It's embarrassing. But amusing. All right, let's go ahead and get that vacuum out. I want that sprint speed. I want the better boost. I want everything. Now, can I make it back? Using this path. You know, um, I think so, Dirty Mop. I'm playing um, on the PC using a gamepad, and for me, it's great. Okay, I didn't do this one yet. I've heard some people say that the controls, they didn't like it. But for me, I've had no problems. I mean, for me, the controls, using a controller, everything works exactly as I would expect. Get some artifacts. Let's see what this area is all about. I, can't wait to analyze this. I know. Nice. Fine. All right. I'm just going to do a little bit on foot. Sometimes with these artifact sites, it's mostly on foot to get to a lot of them, so I'll I'll see what I can find. They have some stuff here that's like suspended in these glass tubes, kind of like Subnautica style. I don't know how to get to them, but I'd like to. I saw that, Alex. Isn't that funny? People are like, I don't want to hear that mech. Or the AI talking to me, and they're like, okay, we will stop it.
There's 14 here. Holy smokes. That's the most I've ever seen. Time for some action indeed. Oh, here's one. I wonder what this could be. What a curious object. Mm-hmm. I think the lighting is so great in this. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get this thing out of here. I'm climbing. Go for it. You can make it. Oh, I believe in you. I believe in you. Oh, my gosh. Well, maybe I believe too much. There you go. There you go. You did it. I, wonder what this could be. I know. I don't know. But here's some more. going to be exciting, Piper. I agree. No, I think it's full release, um, Dirty Mop. I think it's full release at this point. It might just be early access. I, I'm not sure, actually. It's on Xbox, and it's on Game Pass. What? Okay, it's early access. Thank you. All right. Well, man, that goes to show you what I, I know, number one, which is very little. But also, it's just so amazing how this is early access, but, man, it's re got so much stuff done. You know what I mean? The content is, uh, there's, it's really polished. Uh-oh, am I stuck over here? I might have an emergency. Unless, like, oh, I can just jump through that. I thought it was a window. Derp. Yeah, enshrouded. Early access, and yet just rolling. Do you mean enshrouded, or this is getting a content drop this week? Oh, cool. I was actually just playing Enshrouded earlier today. Having a good time setting some big enemy on fire with Fireball. Nice. Alright, so we are actually now, we're 12 out of 14. So we're doing well. I have to tell you, though, um, why didn't I stream the Enshrouded? Oh, you know what? That's a good question. Um, I was just playing uh, offline. I felt like playing, but I couldn't stream at the time. I sure could, though. I could put on on the schedule again. Hmm. I love to do this. Oh, here's the last one. I like doing this because it's fun, but I don't know if it does anything for you besides unlock story. Oh, no, it says new construct, strange signpost. So it does give you like a, like a cosmetic or something. That's actually pretty cool. If you could label your boxes for your storage, that's nice. I could see that being useful. All right, get me in. Let's get out of here. All right, we're going out. Let's see. We got the beach. Beautiful. And we're back at the meadows. 
All right. Let's check on our crops. You know what, Dirty Mop? That's a good question. No, there is not. As far as I can tell, you they might add it later, but as far as right now, you cannot go third person when you are just outside your mech. Oh, I'm out. None of this stuff is ready. Some of that cabbage is ready, but that's about it. All right. They've got some aluminum. Let's go pick that up. We're thirsty. So here's my wish list for this game quality of life wise I would love and I don't know if they ever intend to add it or if it's not interesting to them but it would be cool if they added uh, the ability to hot deposit to your boxes stacks without opening them like if you were in the radius similar to how Terraria does it Even when you have it open, you can't just deposit all to stacks, which is uh, a feature that somebody who's disorganized like me really appreciates. Man, this double storage on the boxes is so awesome. All right, go ahead and make a bunch of rabbit oil. Whatever, we'll need it. Might as well. You're not doing anything. Let's go. We're going to put you to work. Polyberry oil. Sure, I need that. Red crystal dust. Make it. You, what you got going? Stone dust. Get it going. Irrigation hose. Oh, Heathrun, yeah, that's right. Fishing would be good, right? Can you imagine mech-based fishing? No, you can't. Heathrun is asking to add it. Because most farming sims do have that. Let's see here. You could do that, right? With the pickaxe? It's possible. There we go. Alright, I'm going to go and get some more water because we're almost out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I mean, the vacuum cleaner, you could just pull the fish right out of the water. Seems like it. Let's go check on making that nice grub. Alright, so the nice fodder, yeah, we can make that. We'll just make, like, five of it. Actually, we can make more of that I don't want to use I'll make sour fodder that's fine okay I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep so I can get the carrot stuff and boost myself up I could do spike saw power too but I don't think I need that right now for anything
All right. Morning. Hope you had a good night's sleep. Oh my Why god. We try and plant some seeds today, huh? Always good to have more crops in the harvest side. It just makes me cry with joy in farming games when you wake up and it's raining and you get that free like you have crops to harvest and it's raining it is just a special feeling man the corn is no joke it takes a while to grow there it is chromaze we got it You can see on all of this, wherever I missed watering, because I didn't hit the sweet spot, it's very visible. All right, let's go ahead and just plant some chromaze. Hey, Brambo, what's up, my friend? <laughs> it was a fortuitous misclick indeed. All right, let's get all the seeds in there. All right, let me go make sure that we're getting the, the proper oil created. So I can make chromase oil, which is exciting, but I need to make a bunch of karoot oil. Let's go over here, and let's keep it going with that. Try to make the first chromase oil, see if we can get anything. Furnace is here. I still haven't figured out where to get coal. So that's definitely something that I need to discover. All right, these are all planted up. Now let's get the rest of the carrot out. And then we've got some polyberry, sure. All right. Tremendous. There we go. All planted. Do we have anything we want to sell this fine lady? She's selling a hammock for real cheap. We'll buy that. I actually do have a lot of stuff to sell her. So I have uh, geode shards. You know, it doesn't look like she actually buys from your storage. So... I wish they would fix that, but that's okay. Well, that is one thing that could be redressed. Yeah, because I have these petrified eggs and this fossil fish. She'll buy these. So let me sell fossil fish. It's actually getting a really good price. Petrified eggs are also on the on the rise. Now, um, you know, Brambo, I've played both of those on the channel, my friend. I enjoy both games. I should try Satisfactory. I think they're on, um, I haven't played Update 7 or 8, so I should check those out. Mm, let's get some carrot seeds. Another nine on sale is good. Bye now. All right. I think we actually are pretty much set. Let's see how we're doing. There's the carrot oil. What will this do for us when we pick it up? Uh, it's been discovered, and what do we get? We don't know. Yeah, Heath Run, it, cer it certainly does. Um, so the better saw says it can break materials in fewer hits, which is cool. Um, but I can't get it. Can break stronger materials, which is cool. What I wanted was uh, this, I think. This takes um, blue lens Which I don't have. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Well, now we can go faster, at least.
Yeah, I need to check um, update eight from uh, Satisfactory. All right, let me queue up some more stuff here and put some things away, and then I'm gonna go try to feed the guys and get copper. I'll pick that up later. Actually, um, I'm pretty sure that if you don't collect the stuff, it might break. That's another thing that would actually be kind of nice in this game. Speaking of satisfactory is, you know, if you have these resources that these uh, crafting stations rather that spit out resources over time. If you could set up conveyor belts to boxes or, or have them get picked up, maybe that's a later technology you can get. That would be nice. Okay. I'm just putting away the stuff that I don't need to carry. Wow, 1.0 for Satisfactory is sometime this year? That's pretty cool. Alright. So, I still need coal. Like, I have not figured out how to get coal. But I don't know if I've really been to the mountainside coast yet. I did upgrade a little bit. So, let's go check the yellow forest and see if I'm strong enough uh, with my new upgrade to actually do anything over there. Oh, look at my sprint speed. Yes, I am much faster. I knew I would love this upgrade as soon as I got it. Moving faster is one of my favorite things in the game, as long as it's an appreciable difference, and this really is. This is uh, much faster. Now I'm cruising. Oh, Dirty Mop, that's a really, really tough question. I'm going to just chicken out. And, uh, say, oh, okay, okay, perfect, I can clean this place up now, I'm strong enough. <laughs> Underrail is great. And I'm going to chicken out and just um, name some old games that are uh, a three-way tie, but I, I would have to make, like, a top 100 list, and it wouldn't even be in order. Uh, but just, you know, if you think about, for me, just because of what I grew up with, I have such fond memories of the uh, the trifecta of Super Metroid Link to the Past and Final Fantasy 3 6 just a tremendous set of games not that I mean I, I really enjoyed Final Fantasy 4 of course and then if you go to PlayStation Castlevania Symphony of the Night, Final Fantasy Tactics, Final Fantasy 7, Insane, if you go PC, Baldur's Gate 2, Heroes of Might and Magic 2, see Chrono Trigger is a good one, but um, it was not one that I, I don't even know if I actually... I watched my friends play Chrono Trigger more than I did, and I don't know if I actually cleared Chrono Trigger. It's a project of mine, and I've got to do it. Original Diablo was really good. I played... M most Diablo I played was Diablo 2, with the uh, full you know, DLC. You know what? I've heard about that, um, Brambo, that Sur Supermarket Simulator is good. Thank you for reminding me about that. I haven't tried it yet. My, This is just my personal take on it. Um, 
but so far, I've only played um, Lawn Mowing Simulator and Power Washing Simulator. I don't know if they're from the same people that do Supermarket Simulator. I haven't played Gas Station Simulator. Um, I played American Truck, like, the Trucking Simulator. I played that. My only takeaway so far um, is those games are pretty fun, but they're not gamified enough yet. And what I mean by that is the progress, the progression in the simulator games that I've played has been a little bit slow. Like it, it's a lot of grinding, and I, that's probably what they're meant to be. But it's like um, a little bit too slow for me. But maybe Supermarket is a bit different. Like for example, with Lawn Mowing Simulator, I was like, okay, this is pretty fun. This is cool. Like, I'm cutting the grass. I like that. Um, but then it's like, okay, this is going on for about a half hour longer than I'd like it to go on for. And then when I get done, I'm like, oh, I can't afford anything. Ooh, what's this? A new flower? It's a white color flower. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's like the the premise is okay, but there's just not enough goals and things happening to keep me interested beyond the initial like, oh, that's kind of, like, cool and satisfying. It's almost like they're intentionally just very casual games that you just vibe out on. And I get that. Like, I get why some people would be down for that. It's just not 100% my thing. Yeah, like Alex is saying, it's kind of like that. If it was, like, faster, you know, like, um... Well, and see, like, my thing with the lawn mowing simulator was... I actually like cutting the grass, um because I like how tidy the lawn looks when I'm done. Oh, cool, we finished the yellow forest. But it took longer... Once again, life returns. Nice work. I just realized I forgot to tell you what the R in my name stands for. It's robust. There were a few other models, like nimble, efficient, adaptable, and so on. I was built to last. The others weren't. One by one, their signals went out. It was a hundred or so years ago when the last one went dark. Yikes. It's been pretty lonely ever since. So she's the last surviving AI. That sounds cool, Brambo. Yeah, I haven't tried um, House Flipper. I know they have, like, Thief Simulator. So this is only one small complaint that I have, but... Um, you see the ingredients you need for this radio tower. The quest doesn't actually track this for you, so you have to remember what to bring. Um, so I need 12 hardwood, 5 aluminum frame, 3 aluminum electronics, and 8 copper ore to build this radio tower, which is actually kind of cool because I got contacted by somebody else on the island, or the planet, or whatever, and I want to talk to them, but I don't have the, um, the means yet. Now, that being said, um, I want to go home and try to get some of the ingredients. The new resources in this region, Yellow Forest, will not pop until I uh, the next day. Hey, Chloe, good evening, my friend. Oh, okay, so Parking Tycoon um, lets you, like, automate things a little bit more. That's cool. Yeah, like I said, like, the some of the game design I was fine with, 
I just needed a little bit more to captivate me in the ones that I've seen, but maybe I, I've only played two. It's kind of the same sometimes. It's not They're not similar, perhaps, but just in the way I feel about it. A lot of mobile games are also like that, where it's just like... It's not... Like, it, it's too grindy and not complex enough, you know, for me sometimes. But then again, I don't really play too many, so I can't speak to all of them. Maybe there's some ones that are really awesome. Okay, uh... All right, pick up this stuff, and let's see. So I know, let's see what I have in these boxes that I could take. So we need these, we need the hardwood. We need, um, I think I just actually need copper ore, and not copper wire, which is, I have one. I'm gonna put back this and this this all that 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 and there you go and then let's see all right so i'm going to sleep so that i can go back to the area and see if i can get coal Coal would be the really big hit for us. Okay, there's something right there. You could see a new resource type. Please be coal. Because I can't make any glass in the furnace until I make it. Uh-oh. It's one of these days. We got bad guys out here. So we're two areas away from opening this door. All right, the harvest is in danger. It's balloons. All right. Can I vacuum you guys? No, I gotta go. I'm gonna have some damage because I need to fill up my hose. Nope, oh, wrong thing. All right. At least I'm faster. Oh my gosh, my crops. It's killing my crops. No. Okay. So we lost a little bit, but honestly not too bad. They, they do this like little timed stuff but luckily, they're not mean about it. It's not super hard to deal with this. It's just a best practice to fill up your... Uh, your water before you sleep, because these always happen at the beginning of the day. So if you're not prepared, you suffer. Oh, nice, Brambo. You got lucky and you had a a really successful YouTuber comment for you. That's awesome. All right. Mm hmm. I'm watering it up. I 
I got no water left. I gotta get some more. Oh my god, I got out. I keep doing that. Yeah, Heathrun, you need the crops. Um, you can sell it for money so that you can buy uh, the cosmetics and stuff for re like designing your mech, but also for creating more comfort so you can get uh, bigger boosts. Am I being sponsored by this game? No. They gave me a early access copy of the game, but I am not being sponsored by them. No. All right, let's water it up. All right, that's looking better. Okay, almost there. And Heathrun, also, some of the crafting stuff requires... Um, ...the plants and for making the food. Oh, you already said feeding the animals. So it's like you need the oil for all the crafting, and then you need the... ...the f plants themselves for making the food... Oh my goodness, look at that combat roll. Ooh, I actually made it, though. That's the first time I've ever done a full somersault and then been able to just walk away from it. I feel really good about that. Okay. So, let's go ahead and we need some aluminum electronics, I believe. All right. And now it's time to go to the new area and see what we can see. I'm going to stop through the edge cliff, see if there's any copper. If there is not, uh, I'm going to start feeding. I brought the right food to feed the animals so they'll repopulate the copper. Wait, this is not the right way, is it? I mean, it, it might get there. This is the way back to where when you start the game, I think. Yeah, this is kind of where you arrive at. I don't think I can... Uh, maybe I can make it. Oh, boy. Let's see about this. Okay. Okay, it's actually potentially... Yeah, yeah, I can make it from here. Great. I know, the mech flipping is so hilarious. crashed. Can I jump over this? Sure. No. No, I can't. Oh, come on. You Oh, so close. Oh, man. Stand up. Get yourself together. Nope. Do it. Yes, there it is. It is I close line myself all the time in this flip over ragdoll my character it's pretty sweet all right um let's see where's that kappa where am i on the map um i'm kind of going the wrong way here let's go this way Let me through. Really important mech coming through. Ooh, this is mass destruction here. We made it. Oh my. I don't remember seeing this giant, like, dragon skull before. Um, okay, this is a zapper twig. I got it. 
It's a new resource. Okay, well, I wasn't expecting that, but cool. That is a big thing. Man. I'm giving this Norks the... Look, I made this Sour Feed. Ah, this is where you get Blue Crystal. Okay, cool. How are you doing, buddy? Are you okay? You're full. You're full. I need to feed one more of these dudes. I probably will zap myself, right? That's that's guaranteed to happen. So I can plant these things, which is cool, but I'm looking for... Where's the Znork nest? That's what I want to find. Maybe we should leave the mech behind if we want to get close. No, we, we did it. We just fed all these already. I need to feed one more to get credit. I think there's their nest over there. I see it. All right, zapping it. Here it is. But if I feed this one... Oops. Got him. He's happy. Ah, fiber. Well, could have done without that, but that's all right. Okay, there's the beach area. Now, I'm still looking, though, because what I want to find is... Oh, what's this? Oh, it's white color flower. Okay, fine. No, what I want to find is, do you have coal? Is that a thing? Because that's what we're here for. Blue crystal is all well and good. Here's a fossil fish, sure. You can do both, Chloe. So you can... Um, it gives you credit if you feed the animal... For feeding the nest if you feed enough of them or you can feed the nest directly but if you feed the nest directly you don't get any reward from the animal uh, there's blue crystal over there so I try to feed the animal if I can where am I oh this whole thing is yellow forest okay interesting I didn't know it was that quite that expansive Here's a Znork, or 10. I don't have any of the food left, sadly. Mm -hmm. uh, boo. Ah, uh, here's the blue crystal. Beep. Okay. Well, <laughs> can't get it yet. I got to upgrade to chip it. I was like, I don't need this spike saw upgrade. Yes, I do. Oh, oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, this is iron. Okay, so to get iron or that, I'll need to upgrade. Okay, fair enough. Let's go drop off all the ingredients I have right here. I mean, that planet looks like it's been... It's being held together with, like, blue glue. Alright, so I need... Um, two more aluminum electronics and seven more copper ore. So let me go over here to uh, the edge cliffs. Oh, I'm in the complete wrong direction for that, but that's okay. And let's see if we can get some copper. Oh, awesome, Dirty Mop. Yes, I play... I love games, so I just like seeing what's out there. And, you know, I'll give most stuff a try. There are certain genres that I don't really get into very often. Um, but... For the most part, I play a lot of stuff. I tell you what... Yeah, it does look like the Death Star with some 
some uh, glue cracks. You're right. I played a game that was on Xbox Game Pass, and you're going to see a video on the channel of it come out soon. But speaking of play anything, um, I don't know if you guys have played this, but I booted it up. It was called No More Heroes 3. Oh my god, I did not know what I was getting into with that game. And that is certainly not in my t typical wheelhouse. Okay. Let's get the... Let's get the copper. Where is it? Oh, here's a guy. One. Oh, he gave me copper. Love it. All right, um, all right, they're happy, which is good. Let's go back and see if any more copper spawned. I haven't been here in a bit, so it's possible. I helped out the rats. The rat community loves it. Copper. All right, I'm going to get out of the mech. I can feed the last one in here. Nobody saves the world I have played, and it's a good one. I enjoyed that. I turned into a horse in that game. Or maybe it was a donkey. I, I can't remember, but it was funny. Hmm. All right. Oh my god, I see copper. I might cry. This is I need this copper to upgrade my saw. Oh boy. Oh boy. Get up. Oh my god. We're rolling. Oh, I think I threw up. The legs, huh? Well. Oh boy. Flip it. It's very good at standing up. up and ready to go. Can I just ask one very dumb and obvious question? Why can't you do the flip from inside the mech? Like, what am I doing when I get outside the mech to flip it? Seems like you could push that flip button inside. Maybe that's... Maybe I'm missing the point. No, I think I already fed these guys. No, 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 I didn't. Nah, I need one more. Yeah, there you go. Do, 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 do. That sounds funny, Brambo. I haven't heard of that one. Nice, Dirty Mop. The good old panhandle.
All right. It's raining again. Alright, we need uh, this, so we need to make copper wire. To make this, we need five aluminum electronics. Now, I'm going to actually check. I think I might have one lying around. There it is. We do have enough. Okay, great. So now we can go get iron and blue crystal. Now, other things that we need... Let's go ahead and do the farming here. We got weeds. Disgusting. What have I let this farm become? All right, let's go ahead and plant. Oh, we can plant this zapper wing stuff. Yeah, get that in there. Sure. Get crazy with it. Great shot. I like how she compliments you like great shot when it's a, like a homing missile. But then again, it's like an AI that's making it a homing missile. So she's just complimenting a fellow AI like you're so good, AI. Yeah. It's true. There. All right. So, at this point, let's go ahead and just keep getting the chromase oil out, get the carrot oil out, and we can go head over to the radio. We just need copper for that. I think I heard that they redid um, Battlefront. Like, did they re-release Star Wars Battlefront, one of the old ones? But I'm not sure if I'm getting that correct. Alright, so let's go back to the yellow forest. And it's just right in front of me. Well, it's all yellow. It's pretty easy to see. Oh, look at this little shortcut. It's just a, a hop, skip, and a jump. Now, I forgot to bring the food, but... That's all right. We'll be all right. We'll just walk through this old ruined town. Mm -hmm. No big deal. A little rainy. We're looking for blue crystal. Have you seen any? Oh, here's some of the zapper wing stuff, though. Or a zapper twig. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's back to the meadows for this. Sorry, no, no, no. And I do love Star Wars. Oh, cool. Thank you, Chloe. It's March 14th. That's awesome. That's very soon. Oh, God. I've crashed. Now, we were just talking about that earlier. It is certainly sad. If that's the trend. 
Now that was an amazing jump. All right. So we can get, we're going to get both iron and blue crystal. Oh, there's some eggs. Sure. Get it. Mountainside coast. We're not ready for you yet, mountainside. Whoa. Here's the iron. This is what I want. Oh, we can make a house. Look at that. So another thing I learned is the bigger uh, home you make, you know, tent to cabin, now to house, then you get more space that you can build within, like the area of influence increases, that you can build decorations that will link up to, so that you can further boost your coziness. Yeah, it is kind of cool. I'm excited about it. Uh, let's see. Did I do this ruin? Or is this just the door? Not. Or is that the town? Actually, I think that might be the town just down below us. So we did do that. Oh, oh, wait. Can I break this guy? Oh, I can break these now. What's this do? Uh-oh. It filled it with water. Is that a good thing? I don't know. It's interesting. I don't know if that's advantageous or not. Like, is that something I should be doing? Looks, looks cool. Whoa. Oh, no. Mech's gone wild. You gotta bounce out now. Get up. What did you do, buddy? Well, we're trying to have time for action, but we keep falling. It does feel like that, doesn't it? Gives you those vibes for sure. I don't know if Elden Ring counts as that gives you some of those feels it's the combat's different though than skyrim uh let's see all right let's go back and see what we can do with all this iron and blue crystal yeah you're right another spot to just gather up that water it's true all right, what can I go over here at the assembler? I can make a power core, which is good from Noxious Spore. Sure, we'll make that. Get that Karut oil going. Okay, let's get the blue crystal dust going. All right, that looks good. It's fun, Dirty Mop. It's fun. So I, can, I think I could just dismantle that tent. I think I, there's no reason for me to have it. All right, so what I want to do is check the map, and I'm missing something. And what I'm missing is, like, where is it? It's either here or here that I can get. Maybe it's at Stepstone Peak. I'm just missing where I can get coal. I'll go back to the mountainside coast and see if I have the right stuff, but I don't think I do. Morning. 
morning. Hope you had a good night's sleep. It was great. Let's do some exploring today. Let's do it. Who knows what we'll find out there. Yeah, see, so we can make blue glass, theoretically, but I just... You know what? Let me check something. The database. Um, findings. Underground lab is what we found there. Uh, but... Maybe I need to build a radio tower. Which is reasonable, so I can just go get some copper and do it. Now that's a lot of K-Roots. Nice. Alright, we got a lot of good stuff there. We need the copper. Put the iron ore away. No, I need this to sell to the vendor when she comes by. We'll go ahead and put in this, this, this. As much of that as we can. We'll have to open up another box here. This, 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 this. Yes, 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 yes. There you go. Put that away. Looking really good. I don't think I need to carry that. Wonderful. Okay. So I need to water this stuff. Sure. Apparently I'm out of water. Oh, cool, Clo. Huh. I don't know why it wasn't letting me water. Alright, anyway. Maybe I just didn't have it equipped and I was being foolish, which... That does happen. Alright, what you got? So, she's got... In terms of resources... Wheat seeds. Have I been growing wheat? Sold. Oh, um, Brambo, I have my Let's Play as well. Um, maybe if you search for Let's Play, it's got... I have both. So you can see me from the very beginning on my Let's Play of this. Sometimes it's hard because uh, I have a lot of videos and YouTube doesn't make it the easiest to sort them or present them. If you do find a beginner's guide, though, in the description of the video, there is the playlist link for the Let's Play. Oh, okay, I almost died. It was close. Alright, so what I'm going to do actually is... Well, I'm going to finish watering. I probably don't even really need to do this. I'm just doing it... There we go. Because I can't help it. It's it's a farming game. I have to water. It's just an imperative. Alright. So now we're going to go in seeds and we'll put in these wheat seeds. Tremendous. And I have some more seeds. I think I put them all in the box.
Hey, hey, Tenadia. What is up, my friend? Good evening. Good to see you. Yes. I mean, kind of. I'm a mech. I'm a farming mech. So it is a John Deere outfit. It's a tractor get up. This is how farming should happen with a cannon. All right. Let's go ahead and get some good food going. Yeah, you can paint it different colors and you can put different, like, arms and legs and stuff on it to make it look different. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and make uh, some copper wire as much as I can. Alright, let's go. And then I'm going to go try to get some copper and then go find the radio tower. I think you can do yellow. You can do any color that you can find flowers for. I'm not sure if I've found the yellow uh, color flower yet. It starts out when you begin the game. It's red. I painted it blue. Mm hmm. Alright, so I'm going to go up here and get as much copper as I can get. I think there's some theoretically down along the edge over there. Yep, there it is. Oh, there's a ton. Oh my gosh, it's... Sorry, Brambo. Happy day. Now I have 24 copper. And I feel like a million bucks. Alright. Get it. Okay, great. Alright, so what we're going to do is run... To what I presume to be... Actually, I think there might be some copper up here. I could feed these guys to replenish it anyway. Oh, it's stunning up close. It is stunning up close. You're right. One more. And we got it. I'm just going to feed it so that they'll replenish. Hey, farming. What's up, my friend? Good evening. Good to see you. All right, we're going to go over here. Deliver what we can to the radio tower. Actually, you know what? I'm going to stop by the house first. And I'm going to make... Do I need aluminum electronics? I'm just going to pretend like I do. And then I'm going to take some aluminum parts, too. All of this stuff. I'm just going to take it over there and see if that's what we need for the radio tower, which is over there. All right, we're running. We made it. Dee -dee -dee. 
Hey, Chef Smitty. Good evening, my friend. Good to see you. Right, we're going to go over the waterfall. And we'll make it. We did. We made it. Because we are a very powerful mech. Actually, though, I'm realizing that I didn't want to do that. I mean, it, it was sort of the right idea. Oh, my God. What happened? Aw, oh, I fell face first. Poor guy. All right. All right. Okay. So, I need to go this way to get... Oh, boy. Where I want to go. So that's a blue color flower over there that will let you dye your mech purple. Or blue, rather. But you can... Um, I have a color mixer, so I can make it purple with blue and red. I also have white... You know, here we go. Yeah, it is multiplayer. Isn't that cool, Tanadia? All right, we're almost there. Now we're doing it. Oh, a whole bunch of these guys. Uh, there's some more iron. And here we go. Alright, the moment of truth. What do we need for this thing? I have... Testing, we testing. did it. One, two, one, two. Oh, the signal's much stronger now. Can you hear me properly? Oh my god, look my at this guy's picture. Ulf. Ulf. And, uh, I live on the planet next door. The big red one. Okay, I see it. Oh. I run botanic experiments on the local flora, but I've run out of supplies. I see. It would be a huge help if you could send some my way, if it's not too much of a bother. It's not. I promise I'll make it worth your while. Thank you. Okay. Can I just give them to the merchant? I like how this radio... Um, no enemies, Tanidia. It's a peaceful game. Um, I love how this radio tower that I built is just held together by, like, shoddy 2 by 4s for some reason. <laughs> yeah, it, it might fall over at any moment. It's fine. Okay. Frost, good evening. How's it going, my friend? Um, that's a great question. I would say... Maybe... 8 to 10 hours? Something in that wheelhouse? Not very far. I need to double-check the mountainside coast to see if... I think I need to... Up yeah, this is where I need to upgrade my hose. I think somebody was telling me about that, that you could go to other planets. That's really exciting. All right. Um, yes, Dirty Mob. I am indeed. Uh oh, what's all this stuff? Let me look inside here. There's some crystal guys, but there's water. I can't quite... Yeah, my... There you go. 
my uh, hose needs to be upgraded. So we'll look into what that requires. If I could find some coal, I'd be thrilled. But generally, these areas don't yield the resources until you purge them. They need sweet father, huh? Sorry, I don't have it, dude, but I'll take your corn. This is... Okay. Oh, there's a lot of corn here. Cool. Crow maize. All right, and this is iron, which I can now get. Over encumbered. Wow. Okay. Um, let me look at my inventory. What do I want to drop? I'll just drop uh, this fiber. Well, actually, no, wait. These are stones. Yeah, just go ahead and drop two. And let's run. And let's get home. Lexi, good evening. Good to see you. All right. Oh, boy, that is the sun. Yeah, Pine Heights. This is where... Um, oh, you ca yeah, you can, Lexi. I, you just move slower. And I, I don't tolerate that. Pine Heights is up here. And then there's some other areas that I haven't yet, you know, accessed. But I need to uh, purge some places. Pine Heights is where I get my kappa. I don't. I don't. I, uh... Earlier in the stream, I upgraded my move speed, and it's changed my life, so I can't go back. It's like in Graveyard Keeper, once I started drinking the speed potion, I couldn't move at normal speed anymore. I was like, no, this, this will not stand. I will not do this. I refuse. All right, we're going over here. Big jump. New day. Look at that copper coming back in. Oh, no, you're right. No, pine is not where I get my copper. That's Pine is where I... This is where I get my red crystal. I know, Lexi. It really is. Alright, so I'm going to go back here. And uh, let's see. Go ahead and make a bunch of chrome so I'll get that going. I know, I know. We'll put the stuff back. Don't you worry about it. Alright, assembler. Uh, let's see. Play. Fantastic. All right. All right. Um, here, put the put the heavy stuff in there. No wait, I need the seeds. Just put the yeah, put that away. Put that away. That, that. There you go. That can be put away. Okay, now we're cruising. Yeah, Frost, because it's it's so close to the water. I was like, let's do this. All right, so I need a stronger irrigation hose. But to do that, um, I need iron parts and red lenses. So I need glass. So I'm going to need um, Hmm No I don't have enough I'm going to have to keep exploring I think I just have missed coal 
and it's around here. Um, but I'll, maybe I'll follow Clo's advice. Maybe I just missed it in one of the regions, and I, I'm not seeing it. But I need Cole to pretty much do anything to make this glass um, so I can make lenses and all this stuff. All right, so I need to go exploring. Hey there. What's be? Chrome's seeds are on sale. Here, I'm going to sell you my stuff. I got this fossil fish. And I've got I these you drive a hard petrified eggs. I like how she says I drive a hard bargain when she's, like, ripping me, like, not giving me full price. Bye now. Maybe I should have talked to the radio tower to see what he needs. Like, I never... He was like, maybe you'll send me stuff? But I'm like, I can't really... I don't know what you mean by send you stuff. Alright, I'm gonna run around and just, like, pretend like Cole's just gonna jump out at me. So if I look at, for example, this region, Pine Heights... Um, there is a question mark resource that I haven't yet found, so it could be that. Okay, so it's not just me, like, I'm not just missing coal... Oh, okay, thank you. Thank you, Frost. See, it's on the border of Pine Heights and the Meadows. It's on the lower level. Okay, thank you. I don't know how I'm missing it. I'm just, like, going everywhere, like, well, maybe it'll be over here. I really appreciate that, because I would have been just wandering around like a fool trying to figure out where it is. All right, so uh, this is the lower level. Let's see. Oh, it is the same as Planet Crafter, Tanadia. I didn't realize that. I love Planet Crafter. I'm huge into it. So let's break this open and put the water out. Fix that pond up. Woo, there it goes. Is this cold? It's all dark. No. Maybe it's, um, oh, it's back here. Thank you, Frost. Okay. I think for some reason when I was walking around exploring, I just kind of ignored that area. Like, I was like, well, I'll come back for that. And I just never came back. It's just in one of those circular rock things. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay, like this. I see it. Oh, my God. I want to cry. I'm so happy. Okay, so I need to uh, feed everything around here so I can get some more coal. There's really not that much here. So this is, um, yeah, I think what happened was when I came by, I saw that it was like so much aluminum. So I just was like, well, it's all aluminum here. Oh, thank you. There's a little cave that has some in it to my right. I love this. Thank you for the help. Oh, my goodness. Let's see here. It's a bit rare. Okay. All right. Um, oh, I see. Like, back in here? Yes. Oh, my God. There it is. I'm a coal miner. Well, at least they actually gave me a few pieces. It wasn't just one. Okay. I can make glass now, everybody. Oh, here's some, too. Oh, man. The game just changed. We leveled up. You guys saved my life. I appreciate this. All right. So now... Um, pick up as much as I can. Yeah, I need to feed the animals. So 
like I can just get more coal tomorrow. Um, this I'm in Pine Heights, so let's feed some Pine Heightsian animals. Hopefully, they take something that I can provide. Uh oh, over encumbered. Ratman, I got your grub. This is one of my favorites. Rat guy. Ratman. Aw. I don't have any more food. Man, that's a bummer. I gotta make some more nice fodder. I'm over encumbered. It's a disaster. Disaster struck. Uh oh, still over encumbered. Ah, that's one thing I don't like. I wish I could destroy stuff because the game will automatically pick it. It keeps. Like, I keep trying to drop stuff, and the game keeps picking it back up. I don't want to pick this up. I want to destroy it. I want to drop it and not pick it up. Please. Okay. I'll back away from it. Jeez. Yeah, they dropped They dropped uh, the red crystal for me. Whee! I don't like how the game stops whatever you're doing and takes you out of your menu to tell you that the merchant is leaving. I think I've mentioned this before. Number one, I can't do anything about the merchant leaving. And number two, I don't care that the merchant is leaving. Yeah, it really is a good game for chilling. It's so super chill. It's, it's like, it's got great music, cool graphics, and it's just a fun farming game. Alright, now I'm going to go over here and I'm going to put the coal in and we can make, um, let's go ahead and make some clear gl glass. Um, we'll make three to try to make the lenses. Let me see, let me pin what I need to, um, unlock some, oh boy. That is not what I meant. Let's get, this show on the road. get it on the road. All right, let's pin the recipes. So we want to make a better uh, vacuum. This is blue lens battery. I don't have that, but we can make... Um, red lens and then um, the clear lens is actually just for lock on targets which is cool though because it goes to 18 I like that a good bit um, iron parts let's see what we need for that <laughs> nice Tenadia and vacuum harvester range actually that I do want that and then um yeah, so this is, allows you just to farm on the ground, which is sweet. All right. Give me back in. It's raining. All right, I'm going to come over here. And uh, did you finish? Oh, my God. Okay, it's hard to see sometimes. <laughs> I crashed. Uh, okay. I know. We're going to get so messy. Alright, we need iron bars for this. I should probably build another one of these smelters. Is that hard to build? Oh, I never built this weather station, but not really super excited about it. The silo. Oh! I didn't even notice that. It's a... It's only for one resource, but it's massive. Um... Oh, convert biomatter into fertilizer. Okay, well, we could fertilize our crops. That's kind of cool. So let's at least put this down like I'm going to make one. Sure. Yeah, 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 we'll make it. Mm. 
And then need another furnace. That's a great question, Frost. As far as I could tell, it's just so you know. And that um, there's no time limit or anything like that. Or I don't even know if there's timed... Like, the only timed events that I know about are just every morning, sometimes the the bad guys will attack. Like, the you'll have that little mini-game where stuff falls down on your farm. But other than that, I don't think there's any imperative. But if anybody knows... Um to refute that, that's fine. I... How much clay do you need for this? I need six more clay. Let's do it. There we go. Okay, we're going to make um, blue glass. Yeah, the noxious pod, those little bad guys. It's like a balloon, or it's just a weed that falls from the sky. That's pretty much all you have to deal with. It's true, it could change, right? But I think that in the... Um, I think philosophically, they're not going to add enemies to the game. But they might change something about the timeline. Yeah, that's right, Frost. They will break your crops. It's rude. It's very rude behavior that they practice. Um, I'll make this. Do it. Hey, Rat. What's up, my friend? Thank you for subscribing. All right. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, I don't think I need any dust right now. I think we're okay. We're just going to chill until... I can make... Uh, some lenses. Actually... Iron bar. How many can you make? Yeah, make a bunch of these, too. And you're doing well. Now, where do I make a lens? Do you make the lens? You do. All right, I made three of those. Great. Iron parts. Chromase oil. Yeah, easy. All right. So... The clear lens, aluminum electronics, and power core. I can make this lock on target very easily. We're going to make it. Got it. 32 mounds. That's so awesome. All right. So we need red lens and iron parts for this. I think I'm only making blue lens, which isn't the smartest thing to be doing. But we'll figure it out. All right. I guess I could make more furnaces. I don't know why I'm, like, being hesitant. I've got plenty of the stuff that I need. I need to move my house. There's just not enough space to spread my wings here. It is interesting, Lexi, that, yeah, they're, like, a, a hard rule that water is, like, basically your kryptonite. You will not be defeating it. Alright, I'm gonna sleep and see if in the next day the radio guy has a message for us. Was that all of my items being lost? No. What was that pop? Maybe we could put that new building to good use. I fall over all the time, Lexi. Because I run around. Uh oh, weed seeds, everybody. Here they come. I don't think so. We're going to preventatively try to just vacuum as much as we can of our crops. Oh my god, here they come. No. How dare you? Absolutely not. Nope. Give me the crops. Get me the crops. 
Give me the wheat. Get out of here. Nope. Nope. This is rude. You should be ashamed. Somebody is doing this intentionally. I don't know who. But they're bad. Who would drop these on me? That's a good question. Um, Dirty Mop, do you use your crops for feeding the animals, for making oil, and you can sell them as well? Make cash. Oh my god. No. We got them. Just like that. Okay. So now I get to... Um, I know, Frost. That would be so sinister. Alright. We're going to test our new lock-on target. Let's see how this baby works. Look at this. I know, it's interesting. They might change that. I actually kind of hope that they don't. You know how, like, in Traveler's Rest, when it was er at an earlier stage of early access, you basically didn't need to do, like, it was very, very easy on you. There was no stamina. You could just roll around. And then they were like, no, we're going to add all of that stuff that slows you down. Um, and really really stall out the progress and the kind of the game uh, it turned a lot of people off that they made that choice and it it was more expected that you would have stamina like you do in stardew but at the end of the day it's like now nah, it's more fun to just play it like and not have to worry about that all right there we go I'm going to go over here. So, um, I'm on using a controller, and what you do is you hold left bumper, L1, and then you use the right stick to use your seed shooter, and then you can use right and left on a directional pad to, like, change which seeds you have selected. All right, how's it going over here? Did we get the iron bars yet? Steel bar? Nice. Oh, I'm out of coal. Okay. So, can I... Uh, let's dump everything and go get some more. But, let me see. I have six iron bars. That's very good. I have one clear lens remaining. Okay. And then, zapper twig. I have these. This is fine. I'll put this over here for now. Yeah. Let's make some lenses for sure. Oh, I'm carrying around like a million aluminum. That's what's crushing me. Alright, get out of here, aluminum. We love you, but we don't need you right now. We're a huge fan of your work, aluminum. But you gotta go in the crate. You're too heavy. Alright, so we can now make... Um, the red lens takes rabbage oil. Am I out of rabbage oil? I never thought I'd see the day. Makes sense. You're right about that. I'm going to need way more storage. I'm going to start trying to build those silos. Those things look sweet. Plus, the nice thing about the silo is it just like... Kind of organizes it for you. Because it forces you to. Aww. Alright. We'll get some more. Fantastic.
Awesome. Okay. So let's get this stuff. And then we got a little bit of ravage oil, but we need more. Let's make the uh, nice fodder. Oh, that's what I was using ravage oil on, was the food. Oh, I've ruined myself. Who knew? All right, let's go get coal while that's all. Actually, let me queue up some more. What are you making? No, no, no. We need the Ravage for the red lenses. What are you doing? Ravage? Not enough Ravage. Not nearly enough. What do you got? Right. Now make more. Noxious spore me. There you go. Oh, does it work faster if it's in a shed? For some reason, I thought the the furnace couldn't go in the shed because it had that little smokestack. That's good to know. Let's try to build one on top of it then. All right, we're going to try to build it like right there. We did it. It's not built, but it's... Now it is. Now they're going faster. Thank you for that tip. That's awesome. Yeah, that's right. Because when you're in it and when you use the, the structure, you see at the top center, it says increased efficiency. So it tells you the little buff that you're getting. I'm going to go get coal while these guys are just doing their thing. Cutting in. I see some. It makes me happy. Just to know that it's there. Here's some more up here. I see a little water area. I didn't feed them enough. They were like, what? You want more coal? Oh, here's some. Okay. It's, it's a good amount. Okay, we got some. Yeah, we definitely got to feed all the nests to get that real good respawn rate. Alright, here's my dudes. Hi, guys. You. 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 Where'd you leave me? Crystal. Ravage. Okay, that's not bad. Here's my dudes down here. Uh-huh. Got it. Tremendous. Would you give me cabbage? I gotta get the memo out. Cabbage is not acceptable. It's gotta be coal or red crystal.
Boom, boom, boom. Alright, sweet. Oh, here we go. More crystal. Alright. I see you, Rainbow. Alright, I'm gonna go this way. And we did this nest. I don't think I have enough food to feed the rest. Oh man, stone, I know. It's like, oh, you're killing me, guys. Okay, so we're just gonna kinda roll over here. And this looks good. Now we're getting it. Can I make some lenses yet? I sure can. Only one. I need more. More. Rabbage. Get it going. Alright, there it goes. You. Um, I guess blue? You. Red. There it is. Now we're talking. All right. Okay. Rabbage. Red hit me. Now I have three red lenses so I can make vacuum harvester range. And iron parts, what does that require exactly? Um, oh, I can make this. And I can make irrigation hose power. Sweet, so we can go clear a new zone. Yes, Dirty Mop. Different game. I usually do a different game every night of the week. So tonight is this game. And then tomorrow is Quasimorph. Then Tuesday we're going to do Stellaris. Then Wednesday is RuneScape. And then Thursday um, we are going back to Pacific Drive. All right. Let's do this. Bam. Wash away that slime. All right. We need a few more lenses. We'll get that. No problem. Alright, give me that rabbage. Alright, red lens. I need one more rabbage. Yes, Lexi, I love Dave the Diver. I played it a bunch on the channel. I didn't beat it. I got pretty far. fantastic all right we're gonna do that the range oh there's a better backpack batteries um oh okay all I need is an iron frame I think I can actually make that let me go ahead and uh, create a mission and then I can do spike saw damage too. And I think I can almost even do this. I don't have enough iron, but I'm getting close. Oh yeah, this is blue lens. I can do that. Oh yeah, I could do all of these. That's a great question, Lexi. Um, I have a beginner's guide on the channel of Dave the Diver. And, you know, the tips for me for that is that, uh, remember, just like in this game we were talking about it earlier, even though days pass, you could take as much time as you want. Too much carbs, good evening. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and make um, some more red lenses. I don't know if I'll... St um, 
I already have Dave the Diver. I don't know if I'm going to start playing it more to see uh, some more of the content. I know they did some, like, crossover stuff. All right, we're going to sleep. Pine Heights, we need the sweet, sweet coal. Rise and shine, extra farmer. Let's build something jaw dropping today. That's Some right. That'll inspire us while we do a hard day's work. That's right. It was Godzilla and Dredge. All right, we're gonna go ahead and make the Zappa twig oil. You can keep going with that ravage. And uh, this requires... Oh, I can make this. Great. So I can make... Compost. There you go. It's composting. Can I make an iron frame just right now? I need more iron bars. That's sad. But it's fine. All right. Well, how much space do I have left? Okay, I need to put some stuff away. I will put away these, this, that, this. Yep, yep. Here we go. All right, Frost. Thanks so much for stopping in, my friend. Take care. All right, we're going to go over here to the mountainside coast because now we can actually clear that up. All right, here we go. Actually, I should check on the coal while I'm passing by. Because even if I clear up this the, the area, I won't be able to um, pick up any resources until the next day. Now we can do it. And let's see, where am I on the map? Yep, I'll just go through the yellow forest and we will arrive at the mountainside coast. Let me check this radio tower, though. Like, maybe I missed it. Maybe the dude was like, no, I have missions for you. And I just kind of skipped out on him. But it also very well could be that I needed to be able to get through the door to interact with him further. And that's fine. Whoa. I hit the wall. Here we are. Look at all this filth. We're going to clean this up. Oh boy, I forgot to fill up my hose. Well, luckily there's a big thing right here.
Oh yeah, man, this upgrade for the... Uh, that's another thing I really like about this game is the upgrades are no joke. Like, sometimes in, in a game you'll, like, spend all this time grinding and you'll get an upgrade and they're like, increase your, you know, power by 1%. And you're like, well, this is, like, the, uh, the range upgrade on the vacuum is unreal. Like, look at me, I'm standing this far away from the water and I'm getting water. With the... With the starter vacuum hose, you have to be, like, right... Or the starter vacuum, you have to be right up on it. You have to basically be in the water. There we go. That's toast. We'll get some ammo. Get out of here. It's disgusting. This slime. Gross. Uh, it's over here. Okay. I'm like, where's the rest of this slime? Yeah, there's a bunch of them. Yeah, the weeds are super easy to clean up. I agree. These you kind of have to, like, you have to charge up. You have to refill. Luckily, the game is really, really kind about just putting water, like, right by where you're at. Fifty-eight percent. We're gonna get this done. Jackpot. That's right, spring break indeed. So everything is running a little bit later. Oh, wow, I, f I missed all of these. <laughs> okay, well, at least we know where we need to go. Look at that crackly slime. The graphics in this game are really pretty tremendous. There we go. And let's see, here we go. No, no, I don't have the settings at 
frame breaking. I think they're at, uh... Oh, I guess they are. Some of them are. Uh, they're, but they're not at ultra. It's just high. So I have most of my stuff at high setting. You could probably go better, but I don't have... Um, I'd need a b better computer, basically. Unfortunately, the way it works is, like, if I want to stream a game, record a game, it takes even more um, GPU, CPU, RAM, everything. We almost got this. We're at 79% uh, for this region. Oh, I see it right up here. It's getting dark. I got to turn on the old flashlight. I could probably... I'm running it um, in 2K resolution. I could probably, like, if I wanted to run at 1080p, turn the settings up more. But I like the higher resolution. Eighty-five. Oh. Eighty-six. Some weeds would be okay. Like, if they wanted to sprinkle some in. Yes. Too much carbs. I played them both. I enjoy both of them. I was playing um, my time at Sandrock more recently because it's newer and it was on PS5. Whoa. We've got some problems, so we got to figure out where they are. It's a yellow flower. There it is. Somebody was asking me to make it the mech yellow earlier. Now we finally got the yellow. It's my first time finding that color. All right. We're looking for the slime. We know it's somewhere. <laughs> oh, wow, you could see some s stuff over there. I don't know what it is. Yeah, it's, um, both of those games are good. They're more like 3D Stardew Valley. You have, like, farming, crafting, gathering. You manage relationships with people in the town, stuff like that. I think you're right. I think I did leave the area. It's getting yellow. Oh, my God. I was way out of the area. Lexi, you're so right. Thank you for warning me. I was, like, just running forever. Now I need to stay on the sand. All right, Mountainside and Coast, we're going to do this. Ah, look at that shimmer. That evil shimmer. That's what we need to clean up. All right. Where are you, shimmer? There it is. I see it right in front of me.
I like how sometimes in this game, like, you'll be at, like, 95, 96%, and they're, and it'll just be like, and that's good enough. We'll round it up. Yeah, see, look at that. 96. They're like, and you restored the region. Gotta say, I was just taken by the beauty of the scenery. It's completely different seeing it from your mech unit sensors. I know I said I've been watching this planet for 200 years, but until now, it's all been just an array of different values and data. You know, weather statistics, soil salinity levels, all that neat stuff. None of my instruments ever told me what a fallen leaf looks like, let alone a hundred blowing in the wind. I would never have seen any of this without you. We're great friends. And she's like, and that's why it pains me so that I must send nuclear warheads right at your location. Iron. Yeah, it's it's a strange. It's like a southern robot. It's odd. The energy readings are still on the rise here. Keep working at it. We're gonna keep working at it. All right. Awesome. So. We basically have purified two new areas. I think we only have one left. And we've been upgrading our mech tremendously. Ooh, we got iron. We now finally got coal, which was giving me the hardest time. And we've ballooned up over here. Doing great work. Everyone, I'd love to keep playing, but it is indeed my bedtime. I want to say thank you so much for coming out and helping me get a little bit further in Lightyear Frontier. I hope you all have an excellent evening or day. Hey, Arch the Phantom, thank you for following, my friend, wherever you're at. Tomorrow, we're going to be playing some Quasimorph if you want to stop by and try not to uh, get blown away by aliens in space. Lexi, Alex, too much carbs. Arch, yes, my friend. Tenadia, enjoy the game, my friend. Rat, Frost, Heathrun, Dirty Mop, Clo, Brambo. Everybody out there, take care. Have a great one.